In a snap sitting, in a guide, we have two options if you activate it. Active two options called dynamic guides and perpendicular. In this lesson, I want to explain what is dynamic guides. For example, going to a uh, top menu, the dynamic guides is to guide you dynamically with when you want to select something, move something, drop something. For example, I insert a cube. As you can see, it's, for example, uh, if you click and drag it, to form, you want to change the position of the axis of this <coughs> cube. As you can see, a plus, a green plus uh, appear here and says if you want to move in a, as you can see, here is a dynamic guide and you can uh, move it um, in this direction, in a straight direction with 90 degrees. Okay. As you can see, guide you to select and move it, snap to this dynamic guide. Here you can change the angle of the uh, dynamic guide. For example, here is 19. You can change it to 45 degrees. And simply, oh, sorry, click on a space to click and drag. As you can see, it's guide you to uh, move to that angle that you specify in your dynamic angle. As you can see, you can snap to that angle and move straight at that line, this center of object. Or simply you can use draw tool. As you can see, you can uh, draw your line in accurate mode with dynamic uh, snap. Yes, guide you. Okay. For example, if you want to draw in that direction, um, give you another example for doing that. <clears throat> going here, insert to spline. Going to the move tool. Give you an ex interesting example about. Uh, then click and drag it here. Okay. For example, um, sorry, I want to make them in same direction, holding control and click and drag it here. Okay. I draw a tool, the guide is activate a dynamic guide. And uh, we uh, snap, <clears throat> we activate point snap to uh, snap to this point. As you can see, it's guide you directly there. I want to make another guide to this direction. Simply uh, moving mouse over uh, one of these point and a blue point will be uh, appear here. And the second guide will be appear for you. And you can uh, simply guide your next move for this and i want to active the intersection between two guides you can use intersection and you can as you can see two guides intersect to each other and you can draw your spline in this direction and in that direction and simply making your job very inaccurate process as you can see, if you click here, a green uh, plus will be appear. That is your first point. And you going most over one of this angle that you want to move in that direction. And you can simply uh, making your guides and the guide dynamic gun helps you to uh, draw your spline or move your object in a straight line or an angle that you specify in a guide angle. You can simply test them, examine them to better understand what is guideline and it's very useful. Or for example, I want to um, change, move this up and guide you everything that you want in a direction. Okay, this is a dynamic guide, simple and very important to use for your drawing and modeling.
Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.